our first question is, uh, Dr. Chan, some of researchers have said that the stock market prices are like a random walk. If it even possible, is it even possible or done by someone when it comes to a price prediction? What are the suitable input parameters for a model task to do this? So yes, Dr. Mm -hmm. Chan. Yeah. Well, the uh, random walk hypothesis has been formally rejected uh, some time ago, amongst them by uh, Dr. Andrew Lowe, uh, uh, professor of finance at MIT. Uh, he has written a lot of uh, very rigorous uh, papers on this and, uh, and with many other uh, academic researchers. It's been thoroughly uh, debunked. However, uh, that does not mean that it is easy to find repeatable patterns. Um, uh, you know, even though that it is not random. And the reason is that um, uh, the signal to noise ratio is indeed still very small. Um, and uh, also, uh, you know, there are um, uh, issues of regime shifts and also issues uh, that uh, of uh, what is called uh, competition or R for decay. So whatever um, arbitrage strategy that uh, work for a while, uh, and if it has a very significant offer, um, many other many researchers, many traders would have catch on, uh, would have caught on, and uh, they will start arbitraging it away. So it is indeed not uh, easy to uh, find a, a very strong signal. Uh, but that uh, that said, um, it is not impossible. Um, the proof is in the pudding. You can see many quant funds such as uh, Renaissance Technologies, Two Sigma, D Shore, PDD Partners, um, and on and on, Millennium Partners, um, and on and on, are able to generate positive returns uh, every year and uh, significant hour every year. Um, and uh, so our job um, is to uh, you know, find these um, uh, hidden offers. Uh, and, uh, you know, in terms of uh, what uh, parameters are suitable, well, that's certainly a uh, very broad topic. You know, it's uh, each market uh, has their own inefficiencies, um, you know, and one has to differentiate between uh, beta and offer. You know, they are, uh, you know, if the only goal uh, that you have is to uh, generate return, I would recommend that you can just uh, buy and hold uh, the spider uh, and that uh, put it in the brokerage account and, and you know, be happy uh, 20, 30 years uh, later. Uh, but, uh, you know, the, the job of the trader uh, is actually not to generate returns. Uh, it is to generate risk-adjusted return, namely that, uh, uh, you have to make sure that, uh, you know, every year you have positive return because if you are just buy and hold a spider, uh, what you will get is a long drawdown period or maybe very steep drawdown. It is not unheard of for the spider to drop 22% in one day, not in a year, but in one day. So if you want to avoid that kind of a situation, um, then trading uh, is, the, uh, is the alternative. Uh, and um, uh, so I you know, certainly won't comment on what input parameters are suitable because they are certainly very different for uh, different markets and different strategies. 